All right, check it out. I have finally found the two new uh, Baja Versary, uh, the 20 year uh, anniversary of Baja Blast. Mountain Dew has now come out with a point break punch. One of my favorite Guilty Pleasure 80 movies, Point Break. And then the Baja Laguna Lemonade. Check them out right there. We're going to put them up against each other, see which one I like better. I'm kind of excited about both of them. Sometimes, just sometimes, this, um, what is it, mango, because there's mango lemonade right here, is uh, a little overpowering sometimes. I'm really excited about the fruit punch, but sometimes fruit punch falls a little short. So they both have some... Um, I don't know. What's the word? They both have some... <laughs> I'm usually good with my words. They both have uh, some promise. But we're going to see and check both of them out. to the intro. What is up, everyone? It is the endorsement, and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. Baja Laguna Lemonade with Mango Lemonade and Baja Pow Point Break Punch. All right. We're going to save the Point Break Punch for last, mainly because of the name Point Break. Patrick Swayze. I love that movie. All right. Here we go. Keanu Reeves as well. Don't want to leave him out. All right, Laguna Lemonade. So it's mango lemonade, a splash of dew with some uh, Baja, I guess. There's some, they threw some Baja in here. All right, let's take a smell. Wow. Do I dare say that smells like a candle? <laughs> that smells like a Yankee, Yankee candle, like a mango Yankee candle. Wow. All right, let's go. Baja Laguna Lemonade in honor of the 20th Baja Versary of Baja Blast. Let's go. That's interesting after two sips. It it's like you're getting all three of those things. You're getting lemonade. I'm getting a back end hint of um Baja. No. I was I was just testing you. A <laughs> A back end hit of the mango, and then you're getting, yeah, lemonade, Mountain Dew, little splash of the dew, and then mango. And this bad boy right here, this one's pretty good. How many is it going to be? 70? 73 grams of sugar. And I could taste about 72 of them with each sip. All right. This one's pretty good. I'm not going to lie. I was a little hesitant because lemonade with the citrus of Mountain Dew, mango, sometimes a little overpowering, but it's kind of refreshing. All right, that one's not bad. Baja Laguna Lemonade. They're really throwing in the uh, California-isms. Uh, the Californians, I love that skit from uh, Saturday Night Live. All right, Baja Point Break Punch. Man, that'd be great if they got like... Keanu Reeves to do a commercial. It, did he? Did I hear a rumor about that? Forget about the new one, the new Point Break. I'm talking about the old school, original Point Break. Patrick Swayze and uh, Keanu Reeves. Ooh, that's another one. Light up the candle. Light up that Yankee candle. The scent is, yeah, very Fruit Punch-esque. This says a blast of natural and artificial tropical punch flavor. Wish me luck. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. See, this is the thing with punch, with fruit punch. All of the, all of the kids in the pool, all of the uh, fruits in the pool. I like the scent better than the taste, better than the flavor. It's okay. I'm not really, this one I sipped and I got everything. I got the lemonade, I got the mango, I got the, the uh, dew. This, I don't even think I'm getting the dew. And I wanna get the dew. It's Mountain Dew. Dewversary or Baja Versary. All right, so this one, a little lackluster in my opinion. 
I don't know. One more sip. Yeah. I think it's an okay punch. Again, I'm not... I also am not getting Baja. Like, I want to get a little Baja. And I feel in this one, I got a little bit of everything. So, all right. I don't know. I uh, respect the game. I like that they're coming out with the new flavors, especially for the 20th anniversary of Baja Blast. Um, let's give this one 1 to 100. We'll give this bad boy a solid... I'm going to give it a 79. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Mountain Dew. This isn't one I'm going to reach for. It's still not a uh, horrible flavor. I might finish uh, some of it. But man, with the amount of sugar, this one as well, 74. 73 and 74 grams of sugar. Yikes. Now this one, the Baja Laguna Lemonade with Mango Lemonade, I'm going to give this one to 100 a rating of... I'm going to give this one an 87. I'm going to give this one an 87. I still don't think this is one that I'm reaching for over some of my uh, other favorites out there. I'm going for the uh, OG Baja Blast over this one and obviously uh, over that one. But it was fun to uh, kind of find them and uh, shout out the Pepsi guy. I saw him at one store and he uh, didn't have it at that store, but he said, oh, I have them at another store. He called over the, to the uh, other store. I went in met up and uh they hooked me up out of the back because they haven't even put these out yet even though i've seen so many people uh have got their hands on them but they just recently came out so there you go the new mountain dew uh baja laguna lemonade and baja point break punch all right i'm happy i found them and there you go another review in the books please like comment share and subscribe also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media getting the words of my channel or word of my channel out to the masses. In closing, there you go. Have you found either one of these? Yeah, there was no rush. Wanted to wait for them to come out uh, so everyone can kind of get a little taste. I did uh, look for them here and there. Um, but like I said, when I mentioned to the guy, I asked him if he had them at that store. He's like, no, but I have them at another store and I'm going to give them a call. I sounded like Caffeine, made, uh, caffeine Man right there. And on today... Anyway, all right, so listen, Mountain Dew, the two new flavors, 20th anniversary. Let me know your thoughts on both of these, and um, we'll call it a day. 